What's going on YouTube and welcome back to another episode of Road to Max with Converse BCC. Well, in the last video we ended up doing a lot of progress. Uh, we ended up getting the cow fight queen head, lots and lots of slayer. Um, yeah, we pretty much did a lot and I'm not really 100% sure what I want to do next. Um, so I came here to Redwoods, I saw that I was going to get a far, uh, fire making level soon. And I thought, why not just come to Redwoods and AFK a little bit with the Infernal Axe and uh, just get this level while I figure out what I'm going to do next. So, yeah, here I am. I am on the Gargoyle task, and I'm going to try my luck at the Grotesque Guardians. Everybody knows me at the Grotesque Guardians. I'm still going for the pet. Um, I'm getting close to 2, 2k total uh, KC, and so far no pet, so... I think after this fire making level, I'm going to go uh, head there and see if I can get this pet finally. Um, I know you can hear a little bit of clicking in the background. That's not um, me right now. I'm actually voicing over a couple of clips that I have from a couple of weeks ago. And uh, I'm actually playing on, my, on this account in the future, uh, doing a little Slayer. But yeah, I'm going to go back to Grotesque Guardians after this fire making level and uh, like I said, test my luck. And here we have it, level 94 fire making. Uh, I think I ended up getting this level only from doing uh, Redwood, so I've been AFK here a lot. All right, so I ended up doing a couple of trips at the Grotesque Guardians, and I am not happy. Um, I've, I died a couple times, and it's just frustrating because when I do this boss, since I've had, since I kind of have such high KC. Um, Whenever the trip doesn't go as planned, it gets I get aggravated. So I think I'm just gonna say F it. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go to the regular gargoyles and uh, finish off uh, my task here because I was getting extremely frustrated with the uh, grotesque guardians. Um, so whatever, I'm gonna end up finishing off the task here. All right, so I'm going to get my very first combat skill besides HP and range to level 99. I'm only a couple hundred experience away from level 99 strength and ready for the fireworks because here they come level 99 strength coming in. Uh, it's the first time I've ever had level 99 strength. Now let's go and get that skill cape. Oh and by the way I didn't get anything from the superior. It's just a bunch of coins and it's, it's just to tease me but let's go ahead and get this cape. Now, as you can see in the chat, level 99 strength, and we're coming to the Warriors Guild, and we're going to go ahead and get our cape, and it took me a minute to find it because I've never been actually, like, roaming around this building. I just kind of came here and got the tokens and went for the defenders, but I found the guy on the top floor, and I'm going to go ahead and talk to him and get the skill cape. Hello there, Converse PCC, blah, 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 blah. Let me buy the skill cape of strength. Yes. 99,000 coins. Yes, I'll pay for that, sure. And there we have it in the inventory. Oh man, this cape is so cool. All right, continue. And let's go ahead and try this bad boy on. The hood, the cape, and to finish it off, all we need is one moat plots. Ah, uh, you love to see it. Now, let's go hang it up in the cape rack and probably never put it back on ever again. All right, back at my bay, Konar. <clears throat> we are going to get 200 abyssal demons in the abyss. Ah, uh, no, thank you. Uh, no, I'm not gonna do this. 200 <clears throat> in the abyss. No, uh, skip this. All right, next assignment. 160 Califite in the Califite layer. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna do this. This is gonna be pretty quick. I, I just gotta bring out the cannon and get this over with quick. And when I said quick, it don't. This literally only took like seven minutes at the most. Uh, seven to ten minutes at the most. Yeah, this is a super easy task. All right, Duradel, let's be nice now and give me a good task. 152 Hellhounds. I will do this and I'm going to serve. All right, so 
I'm not too happy with this. I thought Serb was way better money than this. Um, so I went to Serb and it went great. I ended up getting five kills. I started off at kill count 125. <clears throat> excuse me. And I ended off at 130. And this is what I have to show. This doesn't even cover the prayer pots <laughs> that um, that it takes to kill this boss. So, yeah. Deep down in a dark forest, there lives a dog with three heads. One named Silas, one named Clifford, and one named Big Bird. <laughs> uh, I messed that up. That, that, it sounded cooler in my head when I tried saying this, but... Uh, yeah, I'm actually enjoying this uh, Cerberus task a lot more than I, I normally did before, and I'm not sure what it is. Um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's that I'm finally using the the Hasta on on Crush, or I don't know, but these skills, these skills have been going by a lot faster than they used to before. So um, yeah, this this boss isn't really that hard to be honest. Um, I got, I kind of got the hang of it, and I think I'm gonna work on a video, uh, you know, on my mobile guides on how to kill Cerberus. But uh, it's a pretty, pretty fairly easy boss to be honest. And here is kill count 132 with our very first uh, drop from Cerberus. Um, it, it really doesn't mean much. They're just teleports, but it's a slot on the collection log, and that's all that matters, right? Now this is embarrassing. Um, I don't really remember what happened. I'm pretty sure it had something to do with my internet because I was getting the hang of servers and I'm not sure what happened. But wait, let me show you how much it costs every time I die just to get my stuff back. So give me a sec. 311k. They might as well make this an instance and just let me pay the 100k like at Vorkath because this is ridiculous. 311k. 311k so after this i ended up finishing off the task and um i ended up getting a pegasian crystal and the only reason i don't have the clips is because i was streaming on twitch link in the description make sure you drop a follow okay so back to scaling and it's only because i like i said at the beginning of the video i didn't know what i was going to do next so i just started doing scaling or whatever level 91 thieving coming in and I can now enter the eighth room of Pyramid Plunder. So I'm gonna go ahead and try that out and, and test my luck. Maybe I get a Pharaoh Scepter. Maybe I get the Pet Rocky. Who knows? But I'm definitely gonna be trying Pyramid Plunder soon. But first, the Christmas event. Um, this year's Christmas event was super easy. Um, I'm not sure if everybody did it, but you get a bunch of cool things. I got a sled and I got this really cool rock that I can walk walk around with, and it looks like a goblin look dope yet again back at redwoods um i really don't know what to do next um i'm kind of stuck between skilling and slayer and i just can't really decide what i want to do next so every time i can't figure out what i want to do i just come to uh redwoods and i just chop down some trees but there we go level 94 wood cutting uh, these levels get longer and longer, but it just gives me more and more time to decide what I'm gonna do next So 826 K to the next level. Uh, I think we're gonna get there pretty fast Okay, so I decided to do a little bit of crafting just because I was close to level 95 And I'm gonna do fletching right after this just to get it to a solid 90 until I figure out what I'm gonna do in this episode <laughs> Still haven't figured it out uh, But here we have level 95 crafting and I think we can make Zenite, uh, what is it, Zenite bracelets? Yeah, we can make Zenite bracelets, which is dope. Um, only four more levels. Oh, and we hit level, uh, total level 2075. Getting some carpal tunnel at the GE. And here we have level 90 fletching, uh, just to round that number out. And I tried to get a little bit of fast escape in there and it didn't really work out all that well. But we can now make dra dragon arrows with level 90 fledging. All right, so I'm gonna go back to Slayer just to see what's gonna, if I can get anything. Uh, 150 Lizardmen. I think I'm gonna go ahead and knock out the uh, elites 
what is it? The Kandarin or is it the Western? I think it's the Kandarin. The Corind. Yeah, the Corind and Kebos. I'm going to go ahead and knock out the Medium Diaries. And I'm going to go ahead and knock out the Hard Diaries. Just so I can wear the Slayer Helmet whenever I am killing the Shamans. How to get some questing out of the way. And everybody knows I hate questing. Tell of the Righteousness or Tell of the Righteous. <laughs> I'm dyslexic. I'm so sorry about that. Tales of the Righteous. And then we had to kill this sneaky snake and run over to this abandoned ship, pick out the little memoir out of it, and then run all the way back to the Hosidia's house and give it to this guy. Just so we can finish a another quest. Uh, hello there, safely back at home, blah, blah. Yes, I did it, it's right here. Take it. And one quest point, 4,000 coins, 1,500 agility, and a certificate and a memoir page. I never completed the memoir. It's hard to believe. Uh, I think I got rid of it. But anyways, I ended up completing it and I finished the diaries. And I have a couple more things I need to do. Catch a blue gill at the mulch island. Uh, Essence mine. Chinchampa. And we are done with the medium current and Kebo's diaries. Uh, don't know what to do with this, so I'll just yeet and uh, blow it up. <laughs> I never did that before. Uh, all right, so I finished the mediums, and uh, the rewards for this are Rada's Blessing. You can now have a 4% chance of catching two fish. Using the Blessing, it provides five daily teleports. Uh, yep, yep, you yep, have 5%. Death Sense is mine. Uh, normal price eight times. Okay, thanks. Give me the blood. Uh, give me the XP lamp so I can train my rune crafting real quick. All right, goes straight to rune crafting. I like the new little interface how it says confirm rune crafting. 7,500 7, XP. All right, now let's see what we need for the hard diaries. All right, so we are almost done actually. We just have three. Yeah, three things that we need to do. So let's go ahead and knock that out real quick. And uh, we'll be right back with more. <sighs> I hate this. I hate this stupid mini game. I've lost artifacts. Congratulations, you played yourself. I know I did. I should have never... This, this thieving method, I do not recommend it. It's extremely frustrating. But I got it over with. Um, finished it off. Take the artifact and this... Task is completed. That was actually AIDS, and I'd never want to do this again. All right. Cast uh, examination on a troll, and I am done with the hard diaries. That really wasn't all that bad, to be honest. And I am back with asking for more, Elise. Uh, yes, please. I completed all my tasks. My Rada's Blessing is upgraded. Uh, now I have 6% chance to do something else. I can now do this, this, and that. Uh, yeah, I just want the XP lamp. <laughs> All right, come on. Continue. S free dynamite. Oh, that's convenient, I guess. Wow, thanks. Okay. Anyways, let's get this blessing, and I think I'm going to grab an extra one. Yeah, let's grab another one. Yep, thank you. And let's train our runecrafting. Confirm runecrafting. Yes. 15,000 runecrafting experience. And I wanted to do one more thing before I uh, started this task. This is right why I really wanted to do it. So I have an extra head from the cow fight whenever I was doing that. Um, I'm going to go into the rewards and I'm going to unlock the Slayer Helmet for the cow fight queen. Cow fight cat. Hat. With a silent K. Confirm. 1,000 Slayer points wasted. Not really wasted, but I used them. So let's go ahead and put these bad boys together. Yes, I do. And there we have it. A new Slayer helmet color unlocked. It doesn't really go with this outfit specifically, but it's still dope. And I think I'm going to go ahead and end off the video there. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Remember, like, comment, subscribe, whatever. I don't really care. Um... But yeah, I really do. Got, I hope you guys enjoyed the videos and I'm going to be making a lot more. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Peace out.